All right, guys, it's been a while since I've done a video, so I figured I'd do a real quick one, just kind of giving you a glance of what's in the garage right now. Um, kind of a mess. Up here in Wisconsin, it's, what, May 20th or whatever, and we're starting to get some snow that melted, but still got plenty of it on the ground, so before I get the street bikes out, which you'll see later on in the year, um, I gotta wait for the snow to melt and the salt to go away. Anyway, this is, here is my son's uh, TRX-90. Some of my old videos, you see him driving around in a yellow one. Um, that was his first Honda. Before that, he had a Kawasaki 110, which I really liked. Then he had a DS90X after that yellow one, which then I sold that and then bought him this, which I really like this machine here with the electric start. It's a really good machine. We've got a couple little pit bikes here. One's a CT70. And this is my personal bike. Um, Want to get going for this year. Needs a little bit of work yet, but it's a pretty clean original bike keep it pretty much the way it is this is a 79 z50 that has um an aftermarket tank it puts a 73 atc 70 decals on it otherwise uh, it's pretty much the way i got it i'm going to change out the forks do some more work to it but it runs good rebuilt motor it has a really cool little exhaust which you can't really see it but it sounds really cool for a 50. um here's uh an 83 atc 110 that's really nice um, not perfect, but in really nice original shape that uh, I got as a non-runner and it was sitting in a barn for many years and cleaned it up and made it, you know, basically didn't do much other than put some new rear tires on it. Had a good front tire that was really nice on it and uh, got that one going. Let's see, here's my 70 project. That's this 85 ATC 70. That one I'm going to do a big bore kit and that'll be my personal one. This here is an 84. That's my son's. I redid some of the stuff so it looks more like an 85. And he has the high bars on his already. There's my daughter's. Hers is a 1980. And uh, it has some of the 84 stuff on it. <clears throat> I think the tank's actually an 83. But um, maybe it is an 84 tank. Yeah. I don't remember. I went through a few of them. and So hers is currently not running in. A, I ordered the uh, condenser and stuff for it. So uh, that should be going. This is an SL100, a 1971. That is a winter project here. I've been kind of slowly getting at it. Once the CB350 is completely parted out and gone, then that'll go on the little bike lift. <laughs> yeah, it'll kind of get cleaned off and turned into a lift again versus a table. And I'll uh, finish doing the few things to this SL and get that one on the road this year. This is going to be the machine I'm going to run for the builder run myself. This is a 1979 ATC 110. has a plastic tank on it that actually came off of that 70. Um, some goofy bars that don't quite fit, so they're really loose on it. Um, right now it has my summer 350X rims and tires on it. But it's going to get a set of mud tires that are sitting back there on the bench. They're 27 inch something or others I bought at some auction so i ordered the rims for it today have to get some spacers it'll be a 4x110 bolt pattern which i already have the hubs on it hence that's why those wheels are on it right now so that'll be a fun one you'll see more videos of that as that one gets going this one has a really cool exhaust system on it too so it uh let's see it sounds pretty cool for a 110 not too bad so um and my wife's machine, her Can-Am 650 Outlander XT, nice machine, you know, Can-Am, good power and whatever. Suzuki, the two Suzukis are bikes for buddies of mine that I've been working on, um, kind of sitting in the back there for now, i got to get to them. That XR70 is a machine that I just traded a uh, KLT 110 for, so it's a nice running little dirt bike. It needs a couple little things done to it, a number plate, and I need to get the throttle so it's not sticky otherwise it's ready to go this is my 700 xx that i bought brand new in 2010 as a carryover model uh i got brand new plastic for it sitting up on the wall there just in case and then of course the another one you've seen videos on is the 86 350x still has the snow tires on it and uh took it out uh this weekend so it's got a little bit of mud on it yet i have to clean it off so um yeah anyway it's a quick tour of what's in the garage right now um old big red rear end that has to get scrapped out but uh there's plenty more stuff in storage units that i got crazy amount of crap a lot of honda stuff because i'm a big hardcore honda guy but uh yeah let me know what you think see you guys later